What is going on, YouTube? It's Hello. your boy Spanko. Today I'm with Kent, Mr. Hey. Team Invoker himself. What's invoking, guys? And uh, uh, Kent came third place at the Toronto Regional. Yep. Uh, I guess. <laughs> go, yo, so, go yeah. ahead, take over. Uh, I played base, 45 card main deck, so I'll just show you the the, the good stuff. Okay. Um, three enchantress, you already know that. Yes. Three right for the brave, the one ups, Gripen plus illegal knight. Uh, How did you just, feel about illegal? Uh, it was good against like some random floodgate, random floodgate cards, yep. and it was good against Mystic Mind, which everyone was playing because of the YCS right? Everyone wants to play Mystic Mind. Uh, it's also le level seven, right? So it, it's at the very least it's an extender yep. or thing. So that's it for the brave stuff. Next is the the broken engine. This is basically like a engine file kind of deck. Yeah, that's why it's called base. But base, yeah. Yeah. So we just played three foxy to summon this or this whatever you're missing. This to search whatever you're missing, and this is the good card that can revive. Yep. So this can become the chaos ruler, and then you can revive something to go to Hulk. Yep. Yeah. So, so I was just milling cards with the stack. Basically, yeah. yeah. You, you like search, mill, whatever. Yep. Uh, so the point of the punk card is to like have extenders, like free extenders, and they're like the, the tuners that you want to summon. You never want to normal this, but I mean, if you have to, yep. you just don't use the effect because yep. you want the right to resolve, right? And then Italy to search this basically. Yep. So nine card for Punk Engine, and my arguably my favorite engine for the weekend. I played the Souls Engine two and two. This was gonna be Prosperity, but I settled for this to so that I can play Herald. Because Red Rose plus this or like Rock Rose plus this is Herald. Herald, yeah. And not only that, this also lets you draw two cards because after turn one you. Ideally, don't need the Faithful plus the um, the Draco back. Yep. So you just send two for cost, draw two. You can draw into side cards, more hand traps whatsoever. So yeah, it's a good dark for you know Chaos Ruler. You need something to finish that is a dark. So yeah, I like playing that. Um, How did you feel about two and two? Uh, two and two was nice. It's a good side out card. Like okay. going second, I just side out. Uh, one of this, one of this. Oh, makes like sense. If, if I need space, because uh, you're drawing a six card, so you you don't like. There's a chance you're just gonna draw into it. Makes anyway. sense. And then hand trap lineup. Uh, three Ash, three Baylor, three Nib. Yep. Uh, this was gonna be draw, but I settled for Nib instead because I thought that more people would play like I don't know, Rogue Deck, Slash, like Sword Soul. Yep. Which more, which a lot of people did. Uh, another good thing about Nibiru's is a light, so you can grab it up Chaos Ruler oh, if you're true. already like comboed up. So you just add this. It's another like form of interruption that you can scare your opponent with because they know even if they break your board, they still have Nibiru to play around with. Yeah, it makes sense. Uh, this could be like Ogre or like any other tuner. I think any other tuner would be nice, so Ogre would be great if you, yeah. you want to play that instead. Because uh, you need some tuner, right, to go to Hulk. And then the honorary hand trap. Of course. Yeah, for breaking boards. It's, I mean, it's not bad going first, you can just set it, but this is mainly for like going second if you lose a die roll. Which I lost six up out of nine. You I lost won, six I won die three die rolls and then six I lost. So, so just before we continue here, you went X1 the whole day, right? Yeah. yeah. And what was your only loss? Uh, it was birds, uh, plunders. Plunders? Okay. Yeah. You got so, barrier statue? Uh, I got barrier statue. I opened this, but they had Book of Moon, so it, oh, I couldn't. Oh, yeah. Yeah. So, okay. Anyway, you still play, it's a good card. Of course. Uh, and then the broken one-ups, I guess the, the Red, Rose, Red Rose engine. One, two, three, that's all you need. I wish it was still at three, it would be nice. But... Yeah, but that'd be too crazy. <laughs> yeah, another one, uh, your way to Dagda, like to Sight Lock. Uh, also can be a material for Hot Red. It, Makes sense. It, it depends on the extender. Another broken one-up. Should be banned, still legal. If you can play it, play it. Like, of course. It's, it's a pretty you gotta win, do what you gotta do. Exactly. You want your things to resolve, so you play Call by the Grave. Foolish for like enchantress or like you can send jet or no whatever you need whatever you're missing. Basically. There's so much utility in this deck. Yeah, like and then I'll choose cosmic cycle. More utility. Yeah, so basically the point of the deck is to like play a flexible like engine kind of deck, so yep. you can put whatever tech cards you want. Uh, there's some versions where you can play like more synchro heavy with like librarian and stuff, but the problem is you can't play more flexible cards. The nice thing about this yeah. too, after I guess I'll see the extra deck, but I guess you don't lose the barrier that hard. Not that hard. Yeah. 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 Okay. Uh, I mean, there's gripping to deal with it. I guess. Of yeah. course, yeah. Yeah, deep barrier, because uh, I'll show you I have a lot of link monsters. Yeah, so that's, that's what why. I mean. Yeah, yeah, that's what I mean. So for links, um, that 
the side lock. Of course. This this can become riser or wonder magician for the side lock, whatever you need. Uh, yeah, nothing to say about it. Uh, this is basically like the OTK access. Yep. Because I play magician souls and like a little bit more darks. I play dark instead instead of Lina. You can play either or or both if you yep. really have space. But the only reason you play this is to go into this into this. Makes Plus sense. you can revive bro broken cards like Mirror Jade or like I don't know DPE. DPE yeah, if it comes up, yeah. Right. Uh, Link Rebo, this can arguably anima the, the, the other level one, one. The yeah. Quest, yeah. I saw Trip play it and I thought it was a good idea, but I just play Link Rebo just in case. Yep. It, either or, it doesn't matter. Uh, and then the Synchro cards, shout out to Chair, Ray Zoo, for Bear. Big shout out to Chair. Thanks to my boy, uh, the sponsor. Um, this was really good because you want to summon this before your Hulk play so you can protect it. They can also tag out on their turn, like the next turn, to revive the site if yep. you want to site lock again. Yep. Or you tag out to Illegal Knight, Griffin, whatever you want. Uh, but yeah, it's a broken card. It's a hundred something dollars. Yeah, reason. for a reason. And then another level 10 to go with that is Cheng Ying. How, how often did you go into this? Uh, so let's say I already have Baron. Yep. And then I go to the site lock play. I have two level 5. Sites are level 5. One of is level 5. So sooner. you go into this. You go into this. This works really well with Snow. So with Snow, you get one, ban uh, one book, and then this will get you two Banish. Plus, oh, it's a really big beater. Yeah, of course. Right? Of course so, yep. uh, and it doesn't trigger just from your own cards. You can just trigger it when oh, your, your opponent, opponent does it. And yeah, everyone it vanishes sense. in some way or another. Wonder Magician or yep. Sight Lock. Uh, Riser, if you can do this turn one to send snow, it would be nice. Otherwise, it's just uh, you can summon this with Halki as well. Yep. And then you send snow. Uh, snow <laughs> and this becomes my favorite tech card for the weekend. Yeah. Uh, Moonlight. So, so, how did you feel about Moonlight? Uh, it was really good in a lot of matches like Sword Soul. Because yep. I get one book with Snow, one bounce with this, and then this plus, uh, sorry, Snow plus Riser yep. will put Snow in the grave. So that's like three interruptions already. That's, that's crazy. Yeah, and it's a level 7. Like 7, 10, and 11 are like the synchro cards best, you want. It's the best levels for you, yeah. And then Chaos Ruler around of every course. punk variant plays Yes, it. of course. Uh, Herald, because I play Magician Souls, it was really good to play around Droplets. Uh, nothing else I can say. And then if you use this effect, you can search Illusion of Chaos for yep. more follow-up. Oh, true. That makes sense. Yeah, ritual. And then another Omni Negate to go with Chaos Ruler, yeah. plus literally any tuner that you have. You can do Veiler, Jet Synchron, whatever. Yep. And then my MVP, my second MVP, I guess, Punisher. This was really good uh, during the event because if, if they don't kill me and yeah. I, I have enough way to get into this. I can just one shot them most of the time. Yeah, this it's really is a good lot of against damage. back row cards. Oh, yeah. back row decks too. They can't out it. Uh, I got this to like twenty thousand at one point. It was just crazy. Twenty thousand. It, it was nuts. Did he actually? That's yeah. crazy. Yeah, it was nuts. Uh, and then side deck, I guess it's people's preference. You don't yeah. have to copy it side card for card, but this would have been in the main. I just chose Nibiru instead. Of course. It's good against mirror matches and other like searcher decks. Anti spell of broken. Course. Every time I drew this, I I already like I knew I won the match. Makes sense. And then D the Crow was supposed to be for Despia. I never played against Despia, oddly enough. Uh, I only sighted it once, like against the mirror, and I only really only saw it once. But it kind of mattered. So yep. I mean, I would still put it here because Despia. Like, it's still a thing. Really it's still a real thing. It's also uh, good against other things, like not just the Despia. Yeah, not just Despia. Like literally any graveyard reliant. Yeah. Basically. And then token collector because. Uh, you can send it with Riser, or like if you can mill it with Chaos Ruler, it's even better. Something else. Yeah. Uh, this, I really, this uh, arguably can be in the main, up to you, what you want, but I just played Nibiru anti Sword Soul, so Makes sense. I didn't have to put that. And then to go with the shooting Riser and anti Birds, anti Sword Soul, uh, whichever matchup this thing, this uh, this is good at. Yep. And then evenly blowout card good second good against back row decks. Everyone's playing like kind of back row or like if you can drop let's evenly something, you probably win the game. So right? I have a quick question about your side deck. I know you said yeah. it's up to preference, but you yeah. didn't play barrier yourself. Yeah. Uh, Did you miss barrier at all? Uh, I I played a, a lot against like synchro like synchro decks yep. and or like birds. Like I played uh, I think against three birds and one Mystic Mind, so D Bears wouldn't have so mattered. So wouldn't matter. Yeah, and then. No Despia, huh? Nine no rounds. Despia. It's, I thought I would play it on Despia, yeah. but I didn't, so I guess it was a good thing. But yeah, uh, Bird is a really hard matchup though. Yeah, okay. Yeah. So that's your hardest matchup. Yeah, so that's it. 15 side, 15 extra, blah, blah, blah. All right. uh, yeah, if you have questions, ahead. feel free. I'll answer you in the comments or whatever. Uh, shout out to Team Invoker. I just have a few shout out, I guess. Um, yeah, go ahead. Shout out to my testing circle. Mariano, Aaron, Aldrin, 
Matthew, the whole Untouched yeah, Club, David NGO for the Punisher, and again, Chair for the Hey, me, the pro yeah. dancer, yeah. So, yeah. Uh, if uh, you guys want to check out Team Invoker, I just want to say that if you guys want to check it out, I'll leave a link in the description below so you guys can check out the YouTube channel. Congratulations, yeah. Kent, on your third profile, place. Buddy. Of course. Yeah. Uh, here's the nice deck box you guys get when you come top four. Yeah, we do. And then first I time. That. <laughs> yeah, first time top four, eh? Yeah, first Congratulations, time, yeah. bro. You deserve all right. it. Yeah. Alright, thank, thank you guys you. all for watching. Make sure to like and subscribe. And with that, it's Banco and Keep Team Invoker. Signing out. Peace. Peace.